Hey everyone, I'm Harleen. It's really nice to see you on our channel. Welcome back. First of all, please subscribe and thumbs up and let us begin this video, which is going to be about how to add a table in your WordPress without using plugins. If you are ready, let's not waste our time and let's start this video. So, as I told you a bit earlier in today's video, we are going to create a table without the use of plugins, so I suggest that we just start the practical part. So uh, we're going to review three methods and the first one is the easiest one. It is the default method right in WordPress. You're basically going to edit the blog post in your Gutenberg editor. You're clicking on add new and then you can cl uh, click on table and insert a table, customize a bit, uh, columns, height, width, etc, etc. And done basically, you added a table without the use of any plugin. This was the first method. Within this method, besides choosing the columns, height, width, etc., you can also choose uh, the header label, the footer label, customize the colors, and uh, basically you can just see on the sidebar what customization options you have. That was with the Gutenberg editor, and now let me tell you how to add a table with the classic editor. First of all, let's change the settings from Gutenberg to classic one and start everything. So as you can see, Classic Editor does not offer you a block to just create a table, but don't be frightened, it is still very easy. You can just go to Google Docs, create a table, customize uh, columns and rows and everything you need, add header, footer or whatever you want, put any data you need, and then copy it and paste it in your Classic Editor. Done. You basically have a table you needed. And for the third method, we are going to use some HTML codes to get the same tables, basically. And let's take a look at this method. So for this method, we are going to use uh, coding. And as you can see, I already have a code over here. I will leave it in the description down below, so you can just copy and paste it. But let me still explain everything from scratch. So first of all, we are opening the table tag to do all the other things then to body and trs to customize the number of columns and rows we need between the trs we have tds so basically with this thing we will get a table two on three then we have to copy this and paste it in the text part and if we click on the visual we can see the table if we click on text we can see the code we want to get that table with the code we copy and pasted, we got, got a table uh, 4 on 3. So those were all three methods to create a table on WordPress without the use of plugin. So guys, that was all I wanted to tell you. If you like this video, thumbs up and share it with your friends or colleagues who may be interested in this topic. Everything was very easy as you could have noticed and I'm sure you can do that. Thank you for watching this. See you in the next video. Bye!